a school bus going the extra mile for its community. In the outback town of Stonehenge, getting a school bus service into gear in 2020 opened doors for local kids. For years, the Laidler family on Kapakai Station, 100 kilometres north of town, juggled running a sheep property and distance education for their four girls. So the bus run is vital. And I mean, you know, the bus run's vital to keep the school going too, I think, because there's a lot of, there's only two children not on the bus run. It was initiated by the principal at the time to run a pilot bus program. From humble beginnings, the pilot succeeded in luring in new students from nearby stations. As you can see, the bus has been a success, with school enrolments jumping from 3 to 17 since the service started in 2020. And none of these country kids seem to mind the 150 kilometre round trip each day. Yeah! But as the dedicated group behind the bus found, it wasn't easy finding the right driver in the tiny town of less than 50 people. 66-year-old grandmother from Warwick, Deb Porter, decided to give it a crack. It's nice to have that feeling that you're needed and that you're doing something that's helping somebody. It's an approach working for these students, where a two-hour round trip to school is worth celebrating. Students, Walker, are we ready? Up, wait, Emma! Who are, who are? Dan Prosser, ABC News, Stonehenge.